All right, guys, welcome to episode 82 of Dope Talk TV. It's your truly low key. Got John here with me, got Jay over here, Remy on the floor. You already know how we're rocking, man. We're back with another one. We appreciate everybody that's rocking, liking, sharing, subscribing. Do just that. Go down in the description, get yourself some merch if you haven't done so already. And thank you to those that have. We're back with another one, man. We're chilling, we're cooling, we're vibing. Pack your ball, pack your bowl. You know what I'm saying? Roll your blunt, roll your J. Let's get to it, man. We're fucking chilling. How y'all yeah, boys man. feeling today, man? Marvelous. I'm fucking marvelous. marvelous. You look marvelous. Ooh, you, you got you got marvelous. the Elton John look going on right now. You Elton know? John's my Lord and Savior. Yeah. Shout out to you. You know what I'm saying? We packing fun yeah. on this side. Elton John over here. Let's a round of applause. Thank you. You know what get I'm saying? Get the fuck out of here. Get the fuck out of here. I'm gonna stop looking cursing. Fucking, looking marvelous. You're not gonna stop cursing. Shut yeah. the fuck up. <laughs> We're pieces of shits, guys. So <laughs> get with it, get the fuck going. But uh, but yeah, man. How you feeling, Johnny boy? I'm chilling, man. We riding. Whoa, whoa. We riding. What you riding over there? I'm just know. gonna <laughs> stop. I'm gonna stop here. We're gonna end it here. I meant to say vibing. I said riding. I don't know why, uh, but he's dude. riding. He's and thinking about something. Yeah, yeah. He's thinking about. about <laughs> Put he some said Alan in. John and all of a sudden he said we riding over on this side so this is for you buddy yeah, yeah, Alan, this for maybe you. you need to pick a better yeah. choice of friends uh, yeah That's I don't all. know man <laughs> It's, I think we're, well. I mean, you're my only fucking friend, motherfucker. So I don't I fucking know. Him. Oh, damn, so I guess fuck me over here. I guess you know what I'm saying. I guess I'm the <laughs> This fucking guy. Yo, 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 fuck off. that side. Nah, I've been nah. rubbing off on John, guys. And we're fucking hype. We're ready. It's kind of ugly out today. I yeah, like it's it. a little bit ugly, bro. You know what I'm saying, but it is what it is. We need the water. We, do. we need the we water. Do. It's we fucking. Dry as fuck. Now our grass is gonna start growing mm. quick but as fuck. Mm. Listen, man, I'll tell you what's gonna start growing quick as fuck. Oh, please tell me because now parents I'm fucking uh, bill after these teens crashed into a sheriff cruiser. Right? What's teen the said. Fuck? Listen to this. Teen said a Tesla was on autopilot when it crashed into a sheriff's cruiser. Oh, I did see something about that. I don't know what the fuck <laughs> happened, but I saw it. A Flagler County deputy spotted a white 2018 Tesla driving on the wrong side of the road after it left the Wawa gas station. The sheriff's office said the car stopped and then backed into a deputy patrol vehicle. Wait, does, <laughs> the deputy conducted a traffic stop on the vehicle and reports said a 14-year-old and a 15-year-old were in the Tesla. One was sitting in the front passenger seat, the other was in the back seat oh when the deputy God. approached the car. According to FCSO, the teens reportedly told the deputy they were traveling from Charleston, South Carolina to visit one of their family's friends. When asked who was driving, they claimed the Tesla was driving itself on autopilot and then it crashed. Well, that's what we're setting ourselves up for. Yeah, but then people try to sue them. But it's like, bro, like, what do you expect, man? Like, look at this, bro. bro like, look at the I fucking don't... specs of this fucking car, bro. I mean, there's so many different fucking models. And, like, for 2021, like, it will go up to fucking... Look at the horsepower. From zero to 60, bro. And... What does that have to do with the fucking... Fucking crash system in that piece of shit. I don't, I don't, no, but I don't no, know, man. You got to be careful, bro. I don't think bro. they were really driving. Nah. That nigga was driving. Hell yeah, he was driving. And then as soon as he says, oh, it's a Tesla, I'm going to just hop in it. Yeah, yeah, like, blame it on the get guy. Get the fuck out of here. We know what's going on. We hey, shout out to you. Round of applause to you for you trying tried. that one. You tried. You tried at 15. It's a fucking it's a good one. It's, it's, it's a, a fucking good one. race car. It is. Nah, those shits are fast, bro. They have never think about how tight car. the parents gonna be, though. <laughs> That's what I mean. Like, mm. the mm -mm. mom said, actually, yeah, let me get to that part because the mom mm. has something to say. The Tesla alone. Yeah. Mm -hmm. That's fucking crazy. Insurance though. ain't gonna cover that shit. Deputy said the parents of the teens were called and the driver's mother said she didn't know her daughter had left the state. <laughs> ah! No, I don't know. Hey, hey, hey. How do you not have a tracking no, system listen, on that? Listen. God saved y'all. Straight yeah, up. We saved y'all from something. For yeah, that's real. how you got to think about it. Not that us. They, you ran into a cop. You're 14 or 15 year old, two girls in a whole other state, bro. Yeah. Bro, like, it, that means yeah. it was cruising for a while. They were cruising. From South Carolina. They were cruising for a while. Yeah, girl. <laughs> and then I'm a party a girl. And I'm a party girl. Uh, uh, you remember yeah. that song? You know, yeah, that those was people that from shit. Norway. <laughs> those people were actually from Norway. I swear, I'm not even playing with you. They're risk of bargains. Bro, that shit brought that back I'm memories from the 90s, bro. Yo, that's yeah. crazy that's that you mentioned that song, and I'm going to tell you why. This is going to be another weird thing that like, I was talking before the podcast. Thanks. My daughter recently came across that song a couple of days ago, and she's been playing it every day, and it's her favorite that's song. Crazy. And now John just mentioned that song out of nowhere. 
Omens, man. I don't know, bro. Good omens. Good omens. Nah, if you don't know, you don't know. If you know, you know. If you know, nah, you know. Facts. If you know, you know, man. Changes are coming. But son, I wanted to get into a little bit was <coughs> growing up, man. You know, we were all influenced down here in the south by somebody different. Some would say Lil Wayne. Some would say Gucci. Some would say Boosie. Some would say Jeezy, right? But the thing with me with Jeezy is that that man pushed trap or die on a young culture. But was sending his kids to college the whole time, like Rod Wave said. And I feel like that's like that like as grown men, we gotta start taking accountability for for certain actions, you know what I'm saying? Yeah. And doing certain things. Cause when you got that big of a following, bro, mm-hmm. and you're talking about trap or die, trap or die, what do you think your your followers are doing at what 12, 13, 14, 15? What we were doing. Yeah, <laughs> and that was I'm like, oh, that's what you gotta do, I guess. Yeah. No. But Meanwhile, the whole time, your son is sitting up in a private school, bro, about to go to one of the best colleges around the country. You know what I'm saying? So it's like, he's like trapping or dying. Why the fuck are you telling me to trap or die? Yep. You yeah, know like, I'm saying? dying, exactly. too. When you was 15, you're like, you know what? That's right. Turn up that Jeezy. We're going to roll up on this motherfucker. <laughs> We're going to move this whole fucking brick real quick, bro. And, then and you get see 45 years for it. Yeah, and then you see when the mom <laughs> shot crying, like, uh, uh, help me. Help nah, me. Bro. You see all the gangsters, man. They all fucking... Eventually turn into like not into the street life. Yeah, bro. You, you because I mean? that's like, the whole objective is to yes. get out. It's yeah. not to sit there and do yeah. it forever, glamorize it, and fucking you get make it look cool. You get fucked when you try to do that, though. It yeah. should be temporary. It should be temporary. Everything. It temporary. should be. It should mm-hmm. be. You come up on a little bit of money, you should invest it and go do something else. Facts. Like it's just really that simple. But people just they get used to that easier lifestyle because it's it's easier. But it, bro, listen, man. Quick money gets you sh- like. <laughs> Long time, Ooh, like yeah. straight. That's up. crazy. That's, that's you quick say money that. gets he you knows. long fucking that's time. Deep. That's deep. People don't know for that's real. Like there, that's bro. crazy, bro. I know straight what up. I'm talking. It's about. It's just hypocrisy, bro. It's the same thing with fucking Cardi B, man. Cardi B's over here, you know, promoting the oh hot girl summer being that. single, fucking like just being a hoe, whatever. Like let's keep it real. She doesn't promo- let her daughter. She's promoting to her music. being a hoe, but she doesn't let her own daughter li- yeah. listen to her music, and she has a whole husband. Yeah. <laughs> so she's telling y'all to go fucking, you know what I'm saying, be a hoe, but she Fuck has a, she life. has a husband. Exactly. And a family. Yeah. You see what I'm saying? It's like we got to start holding these motherfucking celebrities a little bit more accountable for the bullshit that they they push, you know what I'm saying? Yeah. Cuz it's like it's like the industry like you they know, easily they, they force that lifestyle. Yeah. This they, generation it, it's so death easily. by design, bro. bro it's easy. death by design. I swear to God. It's My been fucking like that on fire. I saw that, My man. Shit. <laughs> I was gonna have to call the fight Evacuate this motherfucker <laughs> That's fucking nah, hilarious for real For real for real nah, You that know is, what's fucked up is. is this fucking Florida mom bro That's Florida mom Florida mom Yo, It's hey, always listen, it's man. A, Anything in Florida, Florida Is just nuts you, you don't understand guys Listen Florida anything. mom shows up to school With boxing glove And fights ah, a child I saw the video <laughs> I saw the video of that He, he says saw a the police video. report Said 34 year old Edith Riddle of Jacksonville was, of course, shout out to Jacksonville, man. j up there, boy. I see y'all boys up there, boy. But yeah, Jacksonville was arrested by Duval School school Board um, Police on Thursday, March 18th. An announcement came over the school radio about a fight happening outside the cafeteria at 12, 14 p.m. An arrest report said um, a school safety officer arrived at the scene and found that Riddle was reportedly involved in a physical fight with the victim. Boxes child. (laughs) <laughs> Police said Riddle just left the school with her daughter after meeting with the vice principal. So they came to the school. She talked to the principal and said, oh, somebody's bullying my kid, bitch. <laughs> what are we going to do? Go get the gloves, honey. Riddle's daughter pushed the victim to the ground and threw punches before the suspect also joined punching the victim. <laughs> Who was lying on the ground? A witness also said Riddle appeared to have a boxing glove attached to her left hand. According to the arrest report, Riddle reportedly had the boxing glove on her hand when she arrived at the school and told the cops it was super glued to her wrist so she couldn't take it off. It, uh, Crazy it? shit that only happens in fucking Florida. I'm Holy sure she Mom shows wrong. up with one boxing glove. And she's white. <laughs> oh, yeah, she's white. I'll show you the picture right now. And then Jake can show you the picture later. Of course. Oh, look at Edith. She definitely looks like the yo. type. Yo, she looked like she just came out the farm, man. She probably yo, told she... the cop that the glove wouldn't come off because the meth out. pipe was in there. Yo. You know what I'm saying? That's where she hid the meth pipe. She looked like she boxes kangaroos. She looks like she, she boxes like for she, her life on yeah, the streets. She looked like she boxes kids at middle schools. For mm-hmm. That's what the fuck she looks like. And, <laughs> the fuck? and she looks like she could hit a mean... Crack pipe. That's all I'm gonna say. Oh yeah, Jesus. Yeah. And another type of pipe too, if you know what I mean. Hey. What the fuck? <laughs> Ouch. Ouch. 
<laughs> yeah, bro. <laughs> but listen, bro. That yeah. little voice, man. That little voice that, little that fucking you voice. fucking get. Johnny boy, take it away, take man. Take it away, Johnny. Hey, man. You know, you know that little tiny little voice that we get. You, you know? Do. The one that tells me I need to pee, I'll be back. Yeah, exactly. When you gotta <laughs> take a shit, you gotta take a piss. You but gotta you, fucking do what you're doing. You know what I mean? Nah, but you really gotta fucking honestly, you just gotta take a piss. Just take a fucking piss. <laughs> I don't know what the fuck you're talking about. I'm really fucking hot. But we yeah, talk about that little voice. Oh man. yeah, little voice, little voice. Yeah, we have that little voice sometimes, man. And it's like that little gut feeling when something's about to happen or you just got to do something. You know what I mean? And it's just like, I follow it. Some people don't don't really get it. Some people don't really have that type of like that little gut feeling or they don't believe in it. Yeah, or they like, just don't act on it. Exactly. But yeah, bro, sometimes, hey guys, if you got an instinct to go help somebody know. or to do something for your friend, you know, you call somebody out of nowhere and just let them know you love them and shit. If you get that urge, do it. Yeah. Because that person might be going through something that they really need to hear. You know, that day they needed to hear that and you might need to be the person to fucking tell them. So, exactly. you know, when you get that little voice that tells you like, hey man, check up on your people, you know. Do do a good deed or whatever that whatever that little voice is telling you, man. Listen to it. You know what I'm saying? Like, Always got to listen to that little voice, man. For real. For real. And I, just have faith too, man. Like we were just talking about. Yeah, that. we were just talking about that, guys. For Having those faith. of y'all that don't know, guys, we all believe in God. You know what yes, I mean? Sir. Uh, I haven't really. We we're just talking about uh, starting to study the Bible. Uh, Jay over yeah. here, he studied the Bible before. I haven't completely, so we're going to start doing that. You know, yes, meeting sir. up on Sundays, and uh, Pedro's going to come along too. John's going to be here. Yeah. We're going to start studying. You might just, see it change our lives. Yeah, it might see it change hey, our lives. But regardless, like, I believe in God. You know, we all believe in God yeah. before before any religion or anything like that. Like, I just, I, I have a connection with a higher power, man. And I feel like it's very important, bro. It's important for people to have that in order to really feel at peace. You know what I mean? Like, Remy's over here being a, a, a <laughs> piece in, of shite. While we're trying to get all spiritual. I know, I know But, man. you know. <laughs> John's choking him out now. <laughs> I'm sorry, Look guys. at this guy, man. He's, just being, guy. he's just being needy he's today, guys. Needy Zoom up on this guy. Look yeah. at him. Look at him. I can't say no to this. I, I, can't, I can't say no to him, man. He's man. a hunk, man. Look yeah, at him. Yeah, look at him. He's fucking handsome as fuck. He kind of needs a bath, though. But he needs a... Yeah. yeah he but, looks like he smells like a foot. Guys, if you guys want a Frenchie... <laughs> guys, if you guys really want a Frenchie... <laughs> fuck you. <laughs> Hey, listen, he smells like a fuck. If you listen, really want a Frenchie, bro, this hit my dog up so he can breed it with your Frenchie. Yeah, yeah. Oh, but we don't want none of those fake Frenchies with the eyes bulging out that fucking have like ugly ones. The trembles and shit, all right? <laughs> we fucking the want theme. a good Frenchie. Yeah. <laughs> I know exactly what he's talking about. Yo, know, and, and honestly, man, like having a Frenchie really changed my life too. Like for the better, it taught me a lot of shit because it's like responsibility, man. Like yeah, he really, like he's really needy and shit. But it's like, fuck, man. He's like a baby, man. But it, like, it, like if you really want a Frenchie, don't fucking do it. Just don't fucking do it. Don't do it. Fuck, just don't fucking do hey, it. Look I wanted him. one from the pictures, and then when I saw this guy in real life, I was like, uh, uh, <laughs> I'm a double thinker, all right? Yeah. <laughs> But yeah, guys, fucking nah, he's a double thinker. animals are amazing, though. Like I'm, I'm always have an animal around, bro. Like, damn, bitch, yeah, he's just eating man. your mother. Yeah, bro, what he is was going like, on? kissing that mouth under that beard. Oh, That's what he was doing. Boy. Keep it G-rated. Yeah, bro. for real. Bobby, you gotta chell out, bro. <laughs> Yeah, John, you, you know, every now. day I keep thinking a little more and more that you, my friend, have secrets. Oh, uh. <laughs> <laughs> I just get it. Hey, hey man. No, I'm no, sorry. No. Apparently, I'm fucking popular as so. fuck. No, I'm fucking. <laughs> it's my niece. Nah, Shout bro, out I'm to really her. fucking lit right Shout now. Holy you. shit, bro! It's been yeah, it's been a hell of a lit. fucking what Sunday. What else we got, boys? What else we got to talk about? I man? fucking don't got nothing. You nah, know what I got? Nah. <laughs> Opinions. I got an opinion. Okay, let's, let's hear it. it. Let's, let's hear it. it. What grinds um, your gears? I don't know what grinds my gears. I'll tell you what grinds my gears is you saying all these white people phrases. <laughs> that grinds Peter my Griffin gears. Peter Griffin over here. Peter hey. Griffin, you need a diverse circle of friends, my friend. Yeah, man, you need to change it up. You need more it's Latinos. The, it's the visca bargain in me. It's it, the bargain, it not the visca. Something about the red beard told me. <laughs> What's the difference? We all know. So, guys, check this out. Let's get into this. Um, 
So beards are trending, and I've been feeling left <laughs> out. So I'm going to try to grow a beard. Yo, your beard looks straight, bro, the last time you grew one. They need you, to follow this journey. I want to look bro. like y'all. This is the goal. I'm not going to shave until next year and see what happens. Oh, my God. Right, who's going to follow this journey, guys? Oh that shit, shit, I'll gonna follow be, it all the way. She's going to go mm. from your chin oh, down to your fucking, fucking happy fucking trail. <laughs> Ooh. I didn't mean it like Ooh. that. Ooh, to my happy trap. Yeah. I had one of those since I was 16. Oh, yeah. I I, my unless you want to be like me. I grow it out. It goes to my crack. It goes to my chest. And it goes all the way around. Ooh, that's a bodysuit. That's like a fucking onesie, man. It starts at the back of his neck. Ooh. And it goes all the way down to his gooch. And then it goes all the way up to his chin. Ooh. Ooh. It follows up. The only bald spot I really got naturally is my head. <laughs> okay. 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 <laughs> nah, I swear, bro. It's fucked up. Damn, bro. It's what the up. fucking Willie Mammoth fault. under that shirt he said? Yeah, Some man. women like that, though, because yeah, guess they what? Mean, she they want to feel sh- like they're sleeping on a rug, you know? Yo, I mean? Ivy's had friends a that be like, oh, wall. I love when a man's hairy as fuck. I'm like, oh, that's sh- crazy. Shit. <laughs> there you go. Tell <laughs> me that. Yo, his face, bro. Oh, my God. That dude was like, damn. <laughs> Mommy, I don't know. Like, that's what you want. Know, he was like, "Damn, I'm gonna, I might have to do it. Nah, I'm gonna let it grow out." <laughs> that, that's, that's the face he gave off. Yo, but I always left it like that. Like, I mean, if it gets too long, I'll trim it. You know what I mean? But like right now, it's like it's not too bad. Like, damn, nah, but it can, <laughs> it can, no, it can next show us. I just that, did. I showed it. Right? That shit, oh my god! Yeah. That, shit. that thing looks like it hurts when you, you lay on like, your chest. Yeah. Honestly, bro, corn rolls across your pecs is there's it. A, that's I mean, the new wave. Corn rolls a, across your pecs. <laughs> <laughs> I Yo, I want to get the. I want to get the beard up, like, you know. Bro, he would go Braided? through a pack yeah. of disposable fucking razors shaving his body. I swear. <laughs> he would go through a whole pack in just one shower. Like, just one fucking pack, bro. And it'd probably take two showers. That's fucked up. That's oh, he's clogging the tub for Yo, sure. Yeah, for sure. What do you think about this, bro? You got anything to say about this? What's up? I'll shave his chest. You think I'm scared? <laughs> My dog says, Yo, he, let he, go of his neck piece, bro. bro. That's what the fuck he said. Damn. No, that was my dog saying something. <laughs> hey, he's choking him out. He's like, like, <laughs> you fucking talk right now. You <laughs> fucking talk. <laughs> You're not getting fed tonight. <laughs> piece of shit. No, I was kidding, bro. This no. guy's so spoiled, bro. Bro, he is a spoiled piece of shit. I love yeah. him. I got love for he's him. He's a fucking bro. asshole, too. <laughs> Yeah, he, he fucking run John's life. I love my dog too, man. She Thanks. just be chilling in the back, guys. Just chilling. She just be she's fucking cool cooling, bro. Cause she's a normal fucking dog. It's not a fucking. She's just not a needy fuck. Yeah, a needy little. Fuck Needs to like be on Remy. somebody's fucking nutsack twenty four seven. Yeah, man. <laughs> <laughs> oh, Yo, it's so true too, bro. And his nutsack is bigger than mine. Oh wow! Oh wow! Round right of applause to you. I knew he had fucking secrets. I knew it. Thank hey, you. He compares it. Wow! He just puts them. Was this because they're pornography? Though? Like, is YouTube gonna strike us for that? No, nah, one of my. Clients I don't know. Said you it. might have to put a little happy face over it. No, nah, one of one of my boys, bro. He actually said it, man. He was wait, just, wait, wait, wait. Let me stop you there. One of your boys told said that you Remy? that Remy's sack is bigger than yours. No, one of my wow, boys, guys. We knew it. <laughs> no. <laughs> The cats are out of the bag. One guys. of my <laughs> fuck you guys. One of my boys, I was carrying him right, and I was just leaving, and oh, he's wow. just and he's just like both of you, you guys. Were naked. <laughs> both of you was like naked. One of my clients. That was right after Jose shaved the last part of his bag and his thigh. Yeah. Okay, and I'm leaving, and I had him like this, <laughs> and I had him like this, right. <laughs> And his fucking nuts were just hanging. He's like, "Damn, he got some big fucking nuts." I was like, "Yeah, bro, I need to, I need to fucking breed him." And he just started dying. Yeah, no, you need to find him a bitch, bro. Yeah. Because I want the haters to keep watching too. Because baby, it feels better when it, you know, when people hate. You know? I don't know where he was going with yeah. that, guys. But I'm yeah. gonna stop that yeah. conversation because yeah. it sounded like it was gonna crash and burn yeah. into somebody's <laughs> asshole. So we're not gonna park it Yo, there. fuck this guy <laughs> straight into yeah. somebody's asshole. Yeah. Uh, Nah, bro. Shout out to you, John. He's the real MVP. MVP Look at his face. Man. Look at him. I'm fucking beautiful. Zoom Talking on about that. MVP, hey guys, something that we want to make very clear. All right, LeBron, you're yeah. racist. You're, <laughs> you're fucking racist. Yeah. You're fucking racist. You're racist as shit. All right, yeah, you is. got you. Be- you might be the best basketball player, arguably. You ain't to shit me, now. To me, MJ will fucking <laughs> drag his nuts across your face when he dunks ooh, on you. Ooh. But I thought you said no. Because he doesn't like white people. No, bro, you're just racist. 
Racist as fuck. I don't understand, guys. Cancel Something that's serious. Jam. Something that's serious, Being man. Sarcastic. I've dealt with racism in my life. I understand that there's some racist white people, but guess what? There's racist people everywhere. Yep. There's racist black people. I've met racist black people, racist reeking people. I know, re- racist, I know re- racist I everywhere, yeah. bro. We got to stop making it seem like it's just a black and white thing or now we're like an Asian and, yeah. and black. Yeah. Everybody's yeah. fucking racist. Everyone's racist against somebody. Facts. Everybody. And Everybody's prejudiced. Everybody's prejudiced. Hey, and I've met people that have called me a spick. Facts. But guess what? I got tougher skin than that, guys. And le- unless you come in my personal bubble, you could call me a spick all day. Yeah, if you're really about facts. that life, step into the personal bubble space. Can I keep that thing on me, though? Keep that thing, hey, though. On bottom, though. On bottom. Yeah, yeah, it's, 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 I don't know, man. It's all stereotypes, too. Ooh. You know what I mean? And some, stere- me some stereotypes could be true. I'm, I'm intrigued. Not, you know what I mean? Fed. Hey, Regan's thing? carry knives, guys. Yeah. I don't have one. I have a gun. <laughs> yes. But nah, it's legal. Fast. It's legal. I live in Florida. I'm yeah. a fucking abiding citizen. I have a gun. Yes. So Law abiding citizen. Just know that. Here. All right? Know that. Not illegal guns. Yeah, yeah. We're all legal. All our there, stuff baby. is legal. Yeah. Nah, that's fast. All my guns twisted. I own are under my name. Yes. Facts. Disclaimer. I swear to God. And we're chilling. Vibing. So don't step on our property. <laughs> I'm just saying. Yeah, don't come but over I, here. I'm yeah. gonna have Remy attack you, you fucking. Piece yeah, of Remy's shit. gonna chase gonna you down and your fucking balls. hump your fucking calf Ooh, off. Look Ooh. at him. He won't even look in the camera because he's ashamed. He's a killer. Nah, he don't want you to see them fucking <laughs> the real side. Fucking <laughs> death in his eyes. <laughs> them death. demons in his <laughs> eyes, bitch. <laughs> I'll tell demon. you what. <laughs> I'm high as hell, guys. So yeah, no, nah, for real, for I'm real. High. Nah, I'm pretty but good, listen, man. I'll fucking tell you what. Yeah. We oh. appreciate everybody that came back with another one. You know what I'm saying? Go down in the description, get yourself some merch. We appreciate you. Don't fucking forget, hit the subscription button, hit the notification bell. Don't be a piece of shit, all right? Go ahead, Johnny boy. Let's hear it. One time, yeah. one time. Okay. Better oh. I got plenty of hoes. Oh. I just want to hit it go. Woo. I just want to smoke a blunt and hit it like I'm in the cove. Woo. Yeah. Okay. I'm riding, riding with my bitch. I don't give a fuck, baby. That's it. That's it. That's oh, all. Oh, he's good at Yo, hey, but guys, he blessed you with another yeah, one. Yeah, we appreciate one. you. Tell somebody you love them because yeah. we love you. Yeah. I'm bombing. Yeah, yeah, yeah.